Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Tonight for dinner I'm going to show you something that you can do with leftovers. Earlier in the day I pulled out these individual lasagnas that I had in the freezer that I had made the last time I made a big lasagna for dinner. And it was just the two of us tonight, but I still wasn't sure that that was going to be enough food for us. I also had some leftover sloppy joe meat in the refrigerator that I needed to do something with. So I decided that I would incorporate that into our meal also. A couple of months ago, I made this ring out of taco meat and crescent rolls. And I saw it on a YouTube channel. I think it was called Mama Mel's. My husband loved it. And so I thought, what if I did leftover sloppy joe meat instead of taco meat in this? So I gave it a try. Here I have some vegetable oil spray, the leftover sloppy joe meat, and one package of crescent rolls. That's the Aldi brand. I always have a dog watching me cook. So first of all, I spray a pizza pan. You could use a, just a baking sheet for this with a vegetable spray. And this is so easy. You just open the tube of crescent rolls and break them apart and lay them into a circle with the large end of the roll facing the middle and I probably should have used two cans of rolls because I had more filling than I was anticipating and then just baked it up and used the rest either for lunches or uh, the next night but I just used one can of rolls and here I'm laying it out and it looks like a sun when you're done I'll put the link to Mama Mel's video where she did the taco ring in the description box. So after I get that all laid out, then I start spooning the sloppy joe meat onto uh, the large end of the crescent rolls. And like I said before, I have way more meat or meat mixture here than I have rolls. So um, you might want to double the rolls or if you like a lot of filling, then it's fine. Um, we ate it and it was great. We needed to use a fork with it instead of eating it like a sandwich, but that wasn't a big deal. And the sloppy joe mixture is is wetter than uh, taco meat is so that might have been part of it too for it being more sloppy but like I said before it was just the two of us so I didn't want to add another can of crescent rolls but I really wanted to use up the sloppy joe meat so once you get the meat mixture on the rolls then you're just going to uh, flip the tail end of the roll over the meat mixture and just either tuck it in or tuck it down, smash it down so that it doesn't fly back over. And then I bake these at 375 degrees for uh, 13, 12 or 13 minutes. I believe it was, it was 13. And I even had the lasagna in there at the same time. And so it worked out great. I, of course, um, baked the lasagna for a lot longer than 13 minutes. But you can see it's sloppy. It's fallen out. And, but it's okay. It was just the two of us. And it turned out to be a really good meal. And here it is after it's baked. I still have the lasagna in the oven. So here you have the sloppy joe ring out of leftover sloppy joe mix. 
you could probably um, get really creative with this concept and use taco meat like I did before or you could use leftover shredded chicken uh, maybe with some barbecue sauce if you wanted to or you could use chicken casserole or chicken with a little bit of chicken gravy on it would probably be really good or chicken salad if it was a savory chicken salad and didn't have fruit in it you could use leftover spaghetti meat sauce and make a pizza ring this was really good and we liked it a lot we had to eat it using a fork but if I had um, used the other can of biscuits, it would have been more uh, spread out like a sandwich, I think. So you could do it however you wanted to. Just add a green salad or some fruit and you have a really easy and tasty meal. And any of those combinations with shredded cheese in them or a sliced cheese on top, before folding over the crescent roll would be really good. And I'm showing you the ring with the taco meat one last time, just so you can compare how the two look. And just to note that I added shredded cheese to the taco meat before I spooned it onto the crescent rolls. And one wedge was missing on this when I took the picture. Somebody couldn't wait. So that's about all I have to say about the Sloppy Joe Crescent Ring. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.